Good afternoon, everybody. Came to the park for a free and uninterrupted opportunity to just sit and be to ground. It's been a minute. Kids are back in school, so I have fewer distractions. <laughs> but it's such a beautiful day. And it's not too hot. And there's a nice breeze. So I'm just taking advantage of the opportunity to sit and be and connect with all that is. <laughs> yeah, so I've been um, Placing myself in a space of being available to be more of service. So my guys have been working with me to open me up to being more of a clear channel, a clearer channel. So I've just been, haven't made a lot of videos recently because I've just been sitting with them and allowing them to teach me, work on me, <laughs> show me me so that I can move um, any blocks that I may be holding out of the way. resolve those things that I need to resolve. And that is a process, <laughs> as we all know. So, in this moment, I'm just setting the intention to be open and to allow whatever would to come through that which aligns with the Christ consciousness. And in this moment we will speak. We will speak to the reference to the Christ consciousness for that is what we have come to offer at this moment in time in support of humanity at this time because it is in your hard, so to speak, to integrate and embrace all that is you, all that is divine, and all that is, has been since the beginning, since, since the creation of all that is, you are more than you have come to know, you have more, you are more than you have allowed yourselves to embrace and understand, you have allowed yourselves to be bamboozled, so that so to speak, to it, into the forgetting of that which you truly are, but you are more. You are extensions of the source itself. You are the source in manifest form, and you have come to experience this physical dimension, this physical expression you call Earth. You have come but to experience, to learn and grow, to experience the illusion of separation, to understand how one might become under the guise of being separate, being limited, but no that the time has come to remember that which you truly are for 
upon this plane, in this plane, in this dimension, that you know the time has come to allow that which is the true essence of being to come forth in full fruition for the essence of being is love for there exists only love and in your illusion of separation you have seen that which you might call fear that which you might term evil but know that all is of God, all is of source itself. And that which you see pictured that might serve in opposition to love is merely the choosing to cut oneself off, to pinch off the valve, so to speak, for the valve of love is always in flow, incessantly in flow. But because of that which exists within this plane, that which is free will, you have the ability to choose that which you wish to experience, that which you wish to learn by. And you may choose to pinch off the valve, to cut off the valve to love, but know that even if you pinch it off, even as you pinch off the valve, that the valve still flows. And there is opportunity within each now moment to choose to open. And as you open the valve, you create the conditions under which the valve may be opened further and further and further to the point where you allow that which is your true essence to flow through in full, in full expression. And this is that which we term the Christ consciousness, your true essence of being. So understand that which you hold, for you are physical yet spiritual. You are a soul having a human experience. Come to terms with this understanding. Remember that which you truly are. Allow yourself to embrace that which you truly are. For it is in the realization and the integration of that which you truly are that your world will be changed. And these are our words at this time. Many blessings to you, for we are oneness. The essence of all that is of the Christ consciousness. I hope you all um, allow what came forward to resonate. Take some deep breaths. Sit with it for a few minutes. <laughs> allow yourself to just be in ground. And I hope you take this opportunity, this moment, to make um, this day a great day. Namaste.